attention all CUET exam aspirants. Are you ready to ace the CUET exam and secure your spot in your dream college? If yes, then let's talk about a few common mistakes to avoid for the CUET exam. First and foremost, for you, it is exceedingly important that you know the CUET past papers like the back of your hand. So CUET 2018 to 2023, these six years, you need to know section B, which is uh, question numbers 26 to uh, 100 absolutely perfectly. Okay. Today, the CUET examination is of only 75 questions at 105 minutes. So ensure that you exactly do each and every paper section B very well. Secondly, the time management becomes exceedingly important because 75 questions in 105 minutes. So what you need to do is to make your time count. Every second is important. So before you go into the examination, it is exceedingly important that you analyze the entire paper. And once you analyze the paper, attempt the easier questions according to you first. Okay. So it is exceedingly important that you take first 10 minutes of your time, make each and every question out of the 75 categorized into three parts, easy, medium, difficult, mark the easier ones first, attempt the easier ones first, then go into the medium difficulty, then go into the difficult questions. So easy, then medium, and then difficult. Firstly, categorize, take 10 minutes. You will easily be able to identify approximately 40 easy questions on an average, 20 medium difficulty on an average, and 15 might be difficult, which will be unknown areas for you. Okay, so you should be able to maximize in these 60 questions that you have. And if you score approximately 200 to 210 out of the total marks of 300, you're good to go in the top institutes of the country like uh, Delhi School of Economics and all the other institutes will be expected to have a lower cutoff. Common mistake 2 part B, as I said, every second counts. So it is exceedingly important that if you feel that you're not going ahead in a particular question, leave that question instantly, go on to the next. Third point. There is a negative marking in the CUET examination, so don't do absolutely blind guessing. But if you are confused between two options, take a calculated guess and do it. Because the negative is only one and the positive is plus four. Number four, keep your concentration to 100%. Now that will only happen if you are used to concentrating for one or 40 minutes at a go. Now you will only be used to concentrating for that amount of time if you take the mock tests properly. Each and every test that you take should be like an actual examination. Time uh, yourself and sit with the intent that I am sitting in the actual CUET examination. It will be a good idea to sit at the time of the CUET examination at 12.30 p.m. Time yourself, 1 hour 45 minutes and make every second count so that in the actual examination, your concentration for the entire duration of the 105 minutes will be 100%, not 99% for even one second. And last but definitely not the least, stay calm and be focused in the examination. Take deep breaths and be positive throughout. Agar aap se koi bhi question nahi ho raha hai, ye maan ke chaliye ki sab aapko karna bhi nahi hai. Okay, you are only supposed to do that much jisse aapka proper net score aja hai. Okay, to har ek question ko karna zaruri nahi hai. To agar koi question aap se exam mein nahi ho raha hai, rona nahi hai, positive hi rehna hai, deep breaths ko lena hai and next question pe jana hai. Good luck to all the CUET exam takers. You've got this. All the best.